In the high-stakes global game of electric cars, Toyota has played it cool, one could say, almost icy. They've long mastered the hybrid game, but EVs? Not so much. At least not just yet. Toyota's strategy resembles a careful chess match rather than an all-out electric blitzkrieg. They've chosen the multi-pathway approach, incorporating various powertrains into the mix. So far, it looks like their cautious demeanor is paying off, especially since other makers of EVs are pumping the brakes on further investments amid sluggish sales. Hello dear viewers, welcome back to EVs Queen, we are growing every day with the support from all of you. Subscribe to know more about the electric mobility. We provide the most recent and updated news every day. That's not to say they're sitting on their hands when it comes to EVs. While the BZ4X is their sole battery electric offering in North America right now, Toyota has laid out plans for a flurry of new EVs with 10 launches around the world, including a US-built three-row SUV that's rumored to adopt the BZ5X nameplate. The BZ5X was previewed by the BZ Large SUV concept in December 2021, among numerous other Toyota and Lexus EVs. Judging from other models in the past, the production spec BZ5X will likely look similar to the concept, albeit with the usual adjustments and enhancements for everyday use. The BZ5X is expected to retain the hammerhead shark face which is a common feature among Toyota's EV and hybrid lineup. A sculpted profile with discrete plastic cladding, a wraparound greenhouse, large diameter alloy wheels, and LED taillights that extend above the rear fenders could be among the highlights of the exterior. In terms of footprint, the BZ5X should measure close to 197 inches 5,000 mm along, as the fully electric equivalent of the Toyota Highlander and a rival to the Kia EV9. However, the beneficial packaging of its electric underpinnings would allow more room for the passengers and their cargo in a three-row seven-seater configuration. After all, this intends to be a family-friendly model, with space and practicality being among the core selling points. Although Toyota hasn't yet revealed any interior images of the concept, it's highly likely that the production model will share a dashboard design with a smaller BZ4X, featuring upgraded technology and incorporating elements from newer models such as the Prius. Expect a comprehensive suite of advanced driver assistance systems at ADAS, including the latest Toyota Safety Sense features aimed at enhancing the driving experience. The company remains tight-lipped about the technical specifications of the three-row SUV, but it's reasonable to assume it will utilize a stretched version of the ETNGA architecture. Given its larger size and weight, it should feature a higher capacity battery pack compared to the 71.4 kWh unit in the BZ4X, resulting in improved range and faster charging. In terms of performance, Toyota will probably employ a dual electric motor setup, enabling all-wheel drive AWD, capability and rapid acceleration, putting it in competition with rivals like the Kia EV9. It has been officially confirmed that the upcoming three-row electric SUV will be produced at Toyota's Kentucky plant starting in 2025. This facility currently manufactures the Camry and RAV4 hybrids. The batteries for the EV will be sourced from Toyota's new factory in North Carolina, which recently received an additional $8 billion in investments to quadruple its capacity, ultimately enabling 10 battery lines to be operational. The Toyota BZ5X is expected to serve as the basis for a Subaru-branded version, following the strategy employed with the Toyota BZ4X and Subaru Solterra siblings. This yet-to-be-named model will also be manufactured at the same Kentucky plant as Toyota's, offering another SUV option for the US market. It's likely to share a similar appearance with its Toyota counterpart while potentially incorporating some Subaru-specific characteristics. The introduction of the Toyota BZ Large concept in 2021 coincided with the Lexus Electrified SUV, which shares the same underlying architecture. These concepts exhibit similar proportions and greenhouse designs, suggesting that Lexus may also be developing its version of the upcoming BZ5X. Just like the Lexus RZ, which shares its platform with the Toyota BZ4X and Subaru Solterra, the large SUV could distinguish itself further from its Toyota and Subaru counterparts through unique design elements. A more luxurious and technologically advanced interior, along with the potential for a higher-powered dual-motor setup, 
might justify the Lexus branding and its typically elevated price point. We'll be sure to keep you in the loop with all the details about the Toyota BZ5X. With a planned launch for 2025, we should see camouflaged prototypes hitting the streets in the next few months. And hey, who knows, we might even catch a glimpse of a concept that's inching closer to production. Thanks for joining.